Now this brings us to our weekly Bronny, do you suck? How much do you suck watch? Bronny still sucks. Uh, not doing anything in the, in the NBA. Um, not helping at all. No reason why this man should be in the NBA, James. How do you feel about Bronny? And he, it's coming up soon, man. He's going to be playing his first true, true NBA game here. Yes, he's going to play his first NBA game, and it is going to be a sight to behold. It is like Griffey and Griffey. Uh, James and James, it's going to be wonderful. And then the ne very next day, send him down to the fucking G League because he does not belong in the NBA. He is a little better than I am, and I suck. So what do we got here, Adonis? How do you say it? Arms? Ad Ad Adonis Arms. Adonis Arms. He was he was undrafted, mm -hmm. dude. He is like thirty two points from an undrafted player in the NBA. Yeah, and by the way, if you're listening to us on the podcast, we have a graphic up right now on our YouTube show. So if you want to see the graphic, make sure you subscribe, make sure you like us, and tell your friends. Uh, otherwise, keep listening to it on the podcast in the car. The graphic is basically showing LeBronny James and Arms together and comparing stats. Uh, Bronny's four points to the 32, two rebounds to 11. Um, and, and the numbers just go on and on and on of just how he is just out being outplayed left and right. I, James, I think this is no doubt his basically his Hall of Fame dad. Just it is so bad. It is nepotism at its at its absolute worst. A player in the NBA, this isn't Major League Baseball. This isn't Mike Piazza where you can draft a guy the last pick in the draft, let him die in the minor leagues, but oh no, he's good enough. And then he ends up making it. He ends up earning a spot like uh, Kevin Biggio. We look at Clement. I'm, I'm just throwing out guys that I, I know personally when I was looking at the Blue Jays, like uh, Guerrero, you're looking at uh, Bachet. Like these guys, in minor leagues, you have to earn it. Yeah. NFL, like you have to earn it in camp. They're not going to give it to you. They are going to give him the red carpet and allow him to play when he has not deserved any single thing that he's done. The Lakers, by making this uh, this draft pick of Bronny, they are going to get screwed worse than the victims of freaking Diddy. <laughs> uh, at, at least they know they're going to get screwed. Yes, that's, that's the and, word for that. And it might hurt the Lakers more because you know Diddy has a lot of baby oil and Astro Glide. Yeah, Diddy probably had season tickets and the box that he has to now give up.